been asked a question, what was the last time this Lancaster actually flew? It flew in 1959. We're not sure of the exact date that it was down, but it was down in 1959, came to Nanton. Um, it's been sitting here ever since. When it came, it did not come with engines. So uh, we purchased engines for it. At that point in time, engines were sur surplus. We paid, I believe it was 40 or $45 per engine. <laughs> Yeah, today each engine is now worth about a quarter of a million. Certainly, this Lancaster is not funded by any government source. All of our funds to operate the Lancaster for you come from you. So today, when we are done, please uh, generously find out a donation box and pop some stuff inside the do donation box. Uh, whatever you can afford, five, ten, hundred dollars whatever is in your pocket, we'll be more than happy to put that towards keeping the Lancaster running. While we're uh, waiting for our wonderful fire department to set up here, I'll tell you a little bit about the Lancaster. Um, early 90s, we dedicated the Lancaster to Ian Bazaljet. Ian was the only Albertan to win the Victoria Cross. He was born just outside of Calgary. His family was originally from England. Um, they might went back to England. Uh, he was part of the Pathfinders. It was on his second tour that uh, he was shot down and they were bombing a V1 rocket site. Trosi St. Maxim, uh, his aircraft was badly damaged. His uh, crew, many of them were wounded. He ordered everybody who could bail out to bail out. Uh, he attempted to land the aircraft just outside of Sanant, France and upon Bringing it down into the field, uh, his aircraft exploded, killing himself and the crew members that were on board. Uh, they certainly were not capable of bailing out themselves, which is why he elected to stay with the aircraft and try to bring it down. Certainly, um, he could have bailed out himself, but again, in a moment of trying to save his crew, um, lost his life in that. Three years ago, Three years, we went to St. Sanant ourselves, twinned Nanton with the town of Sanant. Actually, it's a little villa. Uh, there's a, Ian is buried there just outside the church. It's a beautiful memorial. We were actually on the farm where the 
aircraft crash that was quite a quite a unique time to be to be there to see the folks there's a young lad who witnessed the uh, aircraft flying overhead it was in his field that the, air, the Lancaster landed and he was still there when we went there he was probably in his early 80s uh, Simone and uh, it was amazing to talk to him and his encounter with the aircraft and of course the uh, Germans were coming through at the time and so the family hid the Ian's body and uh, now he is just outside the church in Sanan. Uh, we do have a poster, I shouldn't say a poster, a print and a painting inside the museum that depicts um, Ian flying his Lancaster over the town of Sanant and young Smont looking up at the aircraft as it flies over. turn over to the cockpit you're going to hear them go through the pre-flight checkup and then once that's done all you're going to hear is the engines so over to the cockpit uh, ground flight switch to flight master switch is on crossover valve is open generator field switch is on all yellow breakers are on starboard fuel valve is on number two tank Pump is on, drawing four amps. Starboard priming is on.
Show, the Symphony of the Merlins.